Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Binding of Isaac. I think we're going to turn back on the uh, the mod, the item descriptions mod. I had it off for a little while um, because it wasn't like letting us progress with it on. But I think that that's been fixed now and we can actually turn it back on. I'm going to try it for today's episode and I guess we'll see what happens, but... Um, it's very good because there is a lot of, there's a lot of items in this game and it's hard to remember what every single thing does. So I think we're just going to do it like this and hope that, you know, this makes, this makes life a little bit easier for everybody. And by everybody, I mean me. <laughs> I can't believe I just got hit there. You know what? I just got to get into the swing of things, right? This is a very big room to be starting in. Uh, today we are playing as Azazel. We're probably just going to be going down to Satan and the Lamb to try and get those unlocks. That's the plan, at least. We'll see how it actually goes. Uh, and we also need to see if this is going to work with unlocks. Or, uh, well, yeah, I mean unlocks, because... Well, it looks like it's working right now. Because it gives me the description of what this card is, and I know for sure that's what it does. Ancient Recall. Temperance Hermit. Two Hermit cards? Interesting. And a Temperance. I'll take the Temperance, temperance. and probably bomb that before we go. Uh, we should go look at the item room. Great. A mishap. What a great item. <laughs> of course, this is me being sarcastic. It's not a bad item, but like... This is not what we were hoping for. Floor 1 item room. Kind of an item. You feel me? Like, it has its merits, but that's... Like, I'm I'm not gonna, like, hope to get that item at any point ever. Uh, especially not right now. Because there's a lot of things that we could have gotten, and I'm kind of sad that we didn't. Uh, starting as Azazel, as you probably know, but you might not. Uh, our life is a lot easier. We start with a miniature brimstone, which is huge, um, because it's just a lot of damage. Range upgrades can make it go farther, and, um, you know, it's just overall, it's just a good start. A lot of damage and whatnot. We're going to take all of those, grab the full card again, and pretty much just keep on keeping on. I, I'm i surprised that that series of events happened. I accidentally let go too early. Okay. We're going to die, probably. Unless I, like, pick up, the, pick up the slack here. Oh, boy. Thank you for doing damage for me. Let me mishap. That was very nice. Well, I guess we're doing a little bit of damage. It's not, I mean, it's better. Literally, it's better than nothing, but not by a lot. <laughs> uh, we do get some red hearts, which is nice. Azazel doesn't start with any, so any health upgrades in the uh, in the early game are going to be huge. And definitely go a long way as to helping us win. That was that was scary. Dodges are on point though. They have a lot of health. We actually should play this guy. And I'm just going to refill my health to try and maximize what we get from him. Could get a heart from the uh, fires here. Unlikely, but it's possible. He can give us a uh, Devil Deal item, so we definitely want to try and have that happen. Oh yeah, there's so much health here. Hermit card. Eh. We already have one. We don't really... Well, we have three now. <laughs> and I'm not taking any of those down to the next floor, so... We'll see. Full card is better than the Hermit card. Well, is it, though? Hey, we got nine. Speed, range, the whole nine yards. I'm actually going to take the Hermit card, because now that I think about it some more, the Hermit card's going to be a lot better for us, because it's going to give us access to the shop without actually having to use a key, because we don't really have that many keys right now. 10 cents. I think I'm just going to hang on to it instead of using it on the donation machine. It is important to keep donating to that, but right now, I think I'd rather just hang on to it and, you know, see what happens. 
we could use that money in the uh in the shop instead of like using it for the donation machine what i'm trying to say is instead of spending it on the donation machine we could spend it on an item that will help us win which might be a better use of our of our money we shall see hey we get lucky we get petrified poop here the earlier that you get it the uh better the payoff is because you know there are a lot of poops on the first two floors or the first first two layers i should say because there's basement one and basement two but i'm talking about like basement and uh and like cavern or whatever it's called that's like the best time to have it because there's a lot of poops on those two layers and if you get it like floor one that's just so many opportunities for you to actually benefit from it hangman is absolutely useless because you know we're already flying now that's a nice sight to see might be worth going into there you know what it also might be worth doing it might be worth uh passing on some item rooms in order to get some planetariums we've not actually seen a planetarium we've gotten a planetarium item but that was from the i am error room we've not actually seen one uh on this save file yet so that might be worth that might be worth doing it's worth considering if nothing else it's alive I say that and immediately go into the shop or the item room we'll start we'll skip them from here on we'll skip them from here on and see if we can't get one before the last floor we're really strong azazel really does not need much help uh the biggest thing that you want to ask for with with him is just why am i getting that damage up oh it's three dollar bill isn't it yeah it definitely is oh my god we have no tears oh because we have quad shot so three dollar bill is basically just gonna give us a random tier like effect which is you know fine it's it's all right it can be really good it can be really bad honestly we we avoid most of the bad ones because we have it with uh with brimstone so like we can't we can't blow ourselves up or anything like that at least i don't think i don't i don't think that we can i could be entirely wrong maybe i'm just lying to you I don't feel like we can though oh, all right well i would really like a key where'd our card go oh yeah that's right we left it in that room we might use our card to get into the shop and then buy a key i am gonna check these poops though never mind uh let's go ahead and fight this boss dingle is annoying but not really bad per se it's like annoying that's about it <laughs> please goodbye the quad shot really is insanely useful for us probably gonna be passing on devil deals i think we're gonna be trying to go for angel only uh it doesn't really make sense for us to go for devil deals when we have such limited hp yeah, we'll pass. Hive mind is huge. And for only seven cents? I think we have to. It's gonna give us double damage flies and spiders, which is pretty good. We're at 422 cents. We need to max that out to unlock a new character. I'm pretty sure that's what you get that from. So we'll definitely be working towards that. Uh, you get other upgrades along the way, but like, that's the, that's the pinnacle. That's the top of the top upgrade that we would hope for. It's not even an upgrade, but it's just like, oh my god. You gotta calm down, bro. No jumping that fast. Ooh. Got a lot going on here. I'm not feeling bad about this run. Um, I'm feeling pretty okay. Just, just okay, though. Not really, like, feeling great. Um, the only reason for that is just because we don't really have anything, like, hugely beneficial to us. We have a lot of okay stuff. That's about it. I don't know what's going on with some of these tiers. It feels like some of them aren't doing anything. All right, so sacrifice. 50% chance for a coin, 100% chance for a... Yeah, okay, well. We don't qualify for that. 
other, you know, if this happened thing, because, well, we just didn't. And I'm not going to the anime room. I need to remember that. Chariot card, moon card. I'll hang on to the moon card. Um, I, okay. I kind of hate that. I kind of hate that. Let me, when I shoot, I like want to shoot straight ahead. Oh God. That tier literally just about clipped us there. <laughs> Take me to the boss. If we're fast enough, we can make it to boss rush. I don't really think that we have like a boss rush build. I don't think we don't have a boss rush build. Azazel on his own is pretty much a boss rush build. You don't need that much. Like truly, Azazel is the easiest character. Like hands down, that's it's not like that's not like a debate. I, I truly think there's like unrefutable evidence that Azazel is the easiest character to play. You just start with so much damage and everything. We have holy shot, apparently. All right, goodbye. Uh, even more health, that's great. I think we're good to go down. We're not going to the shop. We could go to the... Well, I mean, we don't really need to go to the shop. Or I should say, we're, we don't, we're not going to the item room, but we could go to the shop, which is true. Uh, we should be doing full clears of maps to look for planetariums now that we have skipped an item room. So we will want to look everywhere. We are very fast. You are not going to hit us. And I don't want to stand still too much because I don't want to get shot. I need you to... I need you to stand still, though. I... You motherfucker. Got some nerve doing that. Oh, we found the uh, boss room, which is fine. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll take that. Like I said, we do want to do a full clear, so I'm going to go back and just look around a little bit more. Well, we have infinite keys, so it doesn't make sense not to go look in our shop this time around. Also, we have Paras... Uh, I think it's Parasite that does the split shot like that. If you're wondering why our brimstone was like hitting everything. <laughs> oh, we have quad shot again, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a very scary room. Okay, well. Crisis averted. Almost just took damage there. Not proud of that. Yeah, we should. We have. Okay. Well. I was going to say we have infinite keys, so it doesn't make sense not to take a look, but... Can you come here and die? Thank you. Very kind of you. Uh, what is our pace right now? Yeah, we need to pick up the pace a little bit. If we want to make it to boss rush. I think we have a very good shot at boss, uh, boss rush, actually. So far, no planetarium. Doesn't surprise me. We only have 20... Okay. We only have a 21% chance for one right now, so... What I do actually want to do is not lose our Angel Deal, though, because, yeah, we kind of need that. So let's try not to take damage again before we leave. We're going to skip this one again. I really don't like getting the split shot. And we're going to hang on to this for the next floor. Could get a Miracle Soul Heart from these poops. We didn't, but I didn't expect to either. I actually think it's worth playing this guy. There's a lot of health on the floor. And you could give us something good. So, I'm actually going to play this guy. I'll give him, a, I'll give him like, a fair bit of health. I like to go into the boss with full health, but we'll see. Like I said, the, only, the main reason I'm doing this is just because of how much health is on the floor. We've actually, like, got a lot. So, it's not... It's not a bad thing for us to go back and and get all of these so we can 
maximize our returns here. If we don't go into the boss with full health, it's fine. Uh, I can blow up the temperance machine and we should get some more health out of that. I'm trying to like save that till the end. Okay. Might also bomb the, and by might, I mean we're going to when we go back, bomb the, uh, what's it called? The gambling, the slot machine. There's a heart in the shop, apparently. Nice. Also, uh, using things like the Temperance Machine and then the Demon Beggars does not actually take away from your Angel Deal chance, even though it is Red Heart damage. That's a little bit of a fun fact for you. So if you're ever in this position and you're like, well, I would, but I don't want to lose, you know, I don't want to lose my chances to get X, Y, and Z, do not fear. It doesn't count. It doesn't count as that kind of damage. Give me a lot of pills, but I don't need pills. I need an item. Or Babylon is pretty good. It's gonna give us a ton of damage. Because we actually qualify for it right now. Oh yeah, that's a that's a good amount of damage, I would say. Oh my god, two nickels? That's my lucky day. Take the moon card. No, we're gonna take the uh the world card, because we want that for the next floor. We have some health outside the boss room, so we should be good to go do this. I say we need to pick up the pace and then immediately spend like five minutes doing that. It's fine. Unfortunately, we're going to lose our Horror Babylon when going in here, but it is what it is. Uh, it's not a hard boss, though, so not really anything to be worried about. I can't believe that you just... Wow, we just lost our, our chance because I did not see that guy. He was hiding behind the, uh, the boss. That's, that's pretty unfortunate. All right. Nice. Nice. Very cool. Well, let's go on down, I guess. Go ahead and use this world card. No planetarium, that's unfortunate. Um, our chance doesn't like reset if we use an item room, so we might go in just for this floor and then hope that our 40 something percent chance is good enough for the next one. That's my plan at least, because I mean, we really can't afford to skip on too many more items here. Like, we have good stuff, don't get me wrong, but, like, we are still far from perfect here. We are still far from perfect. Yeah, that's good. 20% chance to just not take damage, plus a soul heart. I'm completely fine with those things. Especially since that guarantees us a angel deal this floor if we don't... As long as we don't lose this soul heart and then take regular damage. Which I don't think that's that, that we're going to. I'm feeling pretty confident. Okay, thanks. Fancy seeing you here. I can't believe that you just hit me. Thought I was... Uh, okay. Let's try not to lose this chance, shall we? Because if I take another hit, that's it. Give me a soul heart. Okay. Die, though? Give me something. Well, that that does it. Monstrance is a new item. Gain two circular auras that damage enemies. The inner aura deals more damage. Seraphim, I already know what you do. Breath of Life, uh, yeah, it's not that's not a good item. I guess out of all of these, I'd rather have Monstrance, but I guess that's fine. It does damage when they're in the aura. Yeah, sure does. I guess that's fine. It's not horrible, but it's just, you know, I mean, it's, it is what it is. Let's put it like that. Definitely not going to be relying on it for damage or anything like that. It's more of a, well, I guess if it activates, then great kind of a thing. Wow. Okay. Well, it doesn't matter. We already got our, we already got our deal. It doesn't matter. I'm just annoyed that you hit me. I'm annoyed more so by the actual the actual act of hitting me than losing our chance. Uh, just trying to look. I don't think that there are any tinted rocks in here. None that I can see, at least. Cage is not that bad. 
Well, I mean, I say that, and then you summon all these things. Very lucky that we just didn't take damage there. Okay. Spawn shot. Do your thing. Oh, shit. We're gonna die. What the hell was that? Stand still. Die. Okay, alright. Here's up. Shot speed up. Here's up is the only thing that really matters, but even then, not really. Um... I think we're just going down to the next floor unless we can somehow manage to find some health. Guess we'll bomb this. No reason not to. They can drop uh, black carts, so I guess it's kind of worth doing. Okay, that was worth it. That was definitely worth it. Uh, we are not going to make it to boss rush. But I don't feel like this is a boss rush build anyways, because I was kind of hoping for some more items, specifically a planetarium, but that did not happen. So, yeah, the chances of us actually getting to uh, getting to boss rush are pretty slim. And the chances of us winning boss rush are even slimmer. But we'll see what happens, right? Yeah, I'm gonna need you to not do that. Uh, I still want to... Ooh, we did get a planetarium. Alright, so this was possibly worth it, depending on what we get in here. Mars. Dash by double-tapping the movement key, becoming invulnerable and dealing four times your damage. Three-second cooldown. Okay. That seems pretty cool. Doesn't really feel like we do that much damage, but... And, uh, apparently I didn't time that right. <laughs> Smashbook, that's fine. Give us a couple of bombs. Anything good? Virus, that's a uh, speed up from poison botch. I wonder if that synergizes with Mars or not. Oh, it sure does. That's pretty good. That makes these enemies that I hate a lot easier to manage. Spider mod. For seven cents, I mean, sure. I can't imagine we're gonna put 69 cents into our donation machine here. I don't know actually what we ended on. Maybe a lot, maybe not. I have no idea. Felt like a good amount. Yeah, that's worth grabbing. Not the key, but... Hey, oh, what can you do, right? Uh, Spider Mod is just gonna show us the health values of enemies, and if things run into him, then he does, like, effects. It's a fine item. Not really, like, the best thing in the world, but it's better than nothing for sure. Oh, God. That just stopped. <laughs> I just kind of stopped short there. I, I was expecting to go further. Than that. I can definitely see the, uh, the benefits of this for sure. Okay, two lock-up pills. And we can get through here for free, too. That's nice. That's nice. Could have actually used that now that I think about it to open that chest, the damage chest, without having taken damage, but obviously it's too late for that now. But for, like, a future reference, now I know. Oh, uh, yeah, let's play this guy. We have a ton of money that we literally can't do anything with. Okay. I did not mean to do that. I guess it's fine, though. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, that's right. We have safety scissors. Never mind. That was a joke. <laughs> We're fine. Soul heart. That's great. Uh, yeah. HP. That's, that's good, too. Familiar is to circle around Isaac. Does that count for you, too, Spider-Mod? No, it does not. All right. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> Kind of funny running into things, actually. Uh, school bag is okay, but we don't have anything to carry. Run into mom, do some damage. I mean, it does four times our regular damage, so it's definitely worth doing it, I guess. If it feels like it's worth doing it. Or f okay, I keep I keep forgetting it has a cooldown. Okay, all right, let's 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 calm down. Let's just do this the old-fashioned way. It's not worth relying on this. 
on this dash for. Also, let's stop doing the corner shots, please. Oh my god. It doesn't matter. We're, it, 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 you know what? Ooh, Halo. That's huge. All stats up. We have a lot of damage right now. Uh, I don't know if that's because of a tier effect. It was. <laughs> we're still doing a lot of damage. Don't get me wrong. We're just not doing as much as I, like, thought that we were. But we're good to go down. Uh, Halo was a nice get. Hopefully it carries us through. We want to get as far as possible. That was in no way, shape, or form worth coming in here. All right. The dash, not not that reliable. Also, uh, the virus is supposed to give us soul hearts every now and then, but I, I feel like that might have been changed, seeing as how we have not gotten any. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe not. Sure doesn't feel like we're getting any, though. And come to think of it, it didn't say it on the tooltip either, so... Actually, I'm I'm almost certain that it was changed. It has to have been, right? You pop up. Thank you. Yeah, it's fine. One makes you larger. I'm less happy about the one makes you larger, but... That's fine. Goodbye. I need some help. I... I don't even know what happened just there. I think my invincibility ran out when I was in front of that guy. We need some health, like, now. Uh, yeah, I'll play you. I got a ton of money. Give me some health. That'd be the best thing that you could do for me right now. A bomb is okay, but I need health. So, like, pay me out with health, please? Thank you. Oh, boy. We have to do this room first, though. Also, it seems like this dash is not very far. Like, it's nice that we have it, but it, it doesn't really, like... It doesn't really do much for us. Where, where, where are you? Come to me and die. Because I know as soon as I come out of my corner, you're going to come up and kill me. Uh, all right, let's go get our health. It's going to give us even more health, plus heal a couple of hearts. Nice, nice. I don't know why I came over here. I already knew this was not the way to go. Okay. Whoa, give me this. It was not worth it. That's fine. I need... I need... Well, I need to find the boss, but mostly I need help. I'm trying, I'm trying to dash. I'm trying to dash. The dash is not worth doing. The dash is not worth doing. That's okay. The more you know. Tom Gritty is not going to be a hard boss for us right now. Mainly because we're flying and also because we're very fast. And most of your attacks are... Yep. Based around things that can't move that fast and also can't fly, so... Goodbye. Damage up. That's very nice. Well, we'll definitely get a mom's heart kill. I'm not worried about that. What I'm worried about is Satan and then the lamb, which I don't actually think we've we've successfully beaten or even seen the lamb yet. Now that I think about it, we were going to go there with Blue Baby, but then, you know, disaster struck. Oh yeah, we have Quad Shot now. Okay. I don't want to I don't want to stay in this room. Let me out. I think it's just hard to do the dash because I'm using a control. I think that is where like 90% of my difficulty is coming from. I'd very much like to get an item from you. Give me an item. Give me something good. I don't know what your item pool is, but I'm hoping for something like good, good. More health is fine. Okay, all right. The invincibility needs to last a little bit longer out of out of stopping. That's um, yeah, yeah. I uh, I don't know how I feel about the fact that like I could be in the middle of a group of enemies after dashing and then just okay. 
and then just like take damage that, that seems like a little bit of an oversight that's just my opinion though okay and sometimes it just doesn't turn on well there goes all of our health for the boss so let's make the most of this because I'm gonna be very unhappy if I die because of this dash I mean it has its uses though like right there that's like that's great Oh, we have quad shot again, so. Oh boy. Got some health. Uh we could go see Hush, but I I, I I I that's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen for a very long time. First the blind, okay. I don't really think it has that much of an impact on us, but maybe I'm entirely wrong about that. Okay. The dash actually came in handy there. And actually, it's going to come in handy because I want to go in here. Thanks, bro. Okay, dash out. Okay, but dash out? Nice. Oh, nice. How lovely. We get to fight death. Okay. Thanks for spawning that on me, bro. Okay, all right. Thanks. 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 Thanks, thanks, thanks. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, that was fun. That's also going to be the episode. I don't feel like doing that again. Um, Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't, leave a thumbs down. If you'd like to see more, consider subscribing. I upload daily at 2 o'clock and 3 o'clock. As always, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. I will see you all in the next episode. So long, everybody.